Hey everybody, I'm Ted from Tabex. In this tutorial, we are going to monetize our Discord community. So we will first link our Discord server to our Tabex web store. We will then set up a package that will automatically invite a customer once they claim or purchase that package. We will also look into how to assign a role and send a message. This way you could, for example, create tiered packages with different kinds of roles and permissions. And we can also tag or mention a customer, for example, to say welcome to the community. In today's tutorial, I will select the option on the right. This way, the main login on your web store will be Discord. If you're trying to do Discord actions alongside a game server, you would want to choose the left option. But like I said, if your main focus is Discord, choose the option on the right. We are then going to give our project a name. If we already have a existing website, we can put that over here. Let's click on continue. And now we are going to install the Tabex Discord bot to our Discord server. Let's click here and this will give us a new website asking what server do you want to add the bot to. When clicking the drop down, you will find any server that you either have admin privileges to or any Discord servers that you created yourself. Make sure you select the correct server and then let's click on continue. I'm going to leave everything checked and then click on authorize. Now comes the hard part. We need to prove that we are human. Oh, actually, that was not too difficult today. And then we can click on go to server. We are now on my Discord server. As you can see on the right, the bot is now online and we also have our welcome message. So we done step one. Let's go to step two, connect your web store to the Discord server. So let's copy our secret key and let's go back to Discord. Then if we do slash link, you can see this is a Tabex command. If we click here, paste our secret key and then click enter or send the message. It says you've successfully linked this server to Discord Demo. Discord Demo is the name of my web store. Top right, we can see we are now connected. Then we need to make sure that the bot has the proper permissions assigned. Going to our server settings and then to roles, we can then just drag the Tabex role to the top and save our changes. This will make sure that the Tabex role can manage any of the roles under it. Then let's create a package by clicking here from the setup or we can click on packages on the left. After giving the package a name, a description, and also set a price, we will then look at the deliverables. If you want more information of any of the features up here, take a look at the video description. There will be a link to a tutorial where I give a overview of all these options. Let's add Discord actions as a deliverable. Now we have our first Discord action. We have three options. When do we want this action to happen? In this case, we're going to select when the package is purchased. We then have to select what we want to do when the package is purchased. Let's leave it on assign role for now. And then it asks us what Discord server. If you have multiple Discord servers, you can run actions across different servers inside of the same package. It says we don't have a log of any roles within Discord demo. Please execute the refresh command and then click here. If we go back to our server settings and go to roles, we currently don't have any normal roles. We only have bot roles. So let's create a role. Let's call this VIP. For now, let's just give it a color and save the changes. Close out of this and then let's do refresh. This will push that new role and our channels to the Tabex store. So now back at Tabex, let's click here. It now says select a role to assign. And we can see that that VIP role that we just created is here. Anytime you add or remove any roles or channels, you will have to do that refresh command to make sure that everything is updated on Tabex. So when the package is purchased, we are going to assign the VIP role for our Discord demo server. Let's add another Discord action. Let's still do the action when the package is purchased, but instead of assigning a role, I want to generate a invite link. Let's keep our server the same. Let's select the entry channel. I only have a general channel, so my options are very limited. You could, for example, create a VIP channel, assign the proper role so they have permissions to see everything inside of that channel, and then as a third, we're also going to tag them and say thank you and welcome to the community. I'm going to move this up, so just for my own sanity. And then let's add another Discord action. Let's also send a message on the server. Then we select what channel we want to send that message to. Let's select general. For the message, I would like to ping the customer. So I'm going to click on help here on the right. And then when scrolling down a little bit, you can see here, it is also possible to ping the customer or tag them. So let's give that a try as well. A little bit of a generic message, but as an example, say hello to, and then the Discord ID, or this will ping them, and then welcome to the community. So let's click on create. It says package successfully created. Let's go back to our dashboard and view our web store. 
Let's view our package and add this to our best cut. Then log in with Discord. Same kind of pop-up as before. Make sure you're signed into the correct account and then let's authorize. It then asks us for our email address. Let's fill in our email address and then let's click on continue. It tells us it's going to send the invite link to our email address. Let's proceed to checkout and fill in our information. This is a test payment so we can just complete the order and then complete payment. Our order is complete. Let's go back to the general channel. And here we can see that message, say hello, and then it tags me, welcome to the community. Exactly what we expected. Quickly, before we wrap this up, on that same help page, if you scroll down, you can find some information about custom templates. If you're using a custom template, make sure it is ready for the login with Discord action. Hopefully this was helpful. If anything is unclear, feel free to leave a comment down below. And as always, thank you for watching. If you're not done watching yet, you can click here on the right for our latest release or on the left for something that we think suits you best. If you think I want even more, of course, feel free to subscribe. This way you will be notified when we release new content every Friday. And as always, thank you for watching and good luck with your Tevex store.